And Rottnest Island's struggle to attract holiday makers has been given a boost with the go-ahead for a new development. The 120-room lavish hotel and spa will be built overlooking Longreach Bay. Louise Momba reports. This is the new face of Rotnest, an upmarket hotel spread across four hectares above Longreach Bay, with rooms for couples and families, plus a restaurant, spa and gym. I'm longing for this to be open. Marilyn Paspali's company Pink Tata beat international names for the right to build this hotel. Parts of the layout are similar to the Pink Tata Resort in Broome, which opened last year. The aim to build an environmentally friendly building that complements the island's landscape. I, I really am very aware of the sensitivities of Rottnest. I actually take them on board as, as absolutely relevant. The Rottnest Island Authority won't say what it's likely to cost to stay at the hotel, but says it's pitched at a more corporate clientele. BIM provides uh, more people for the businesses on the island spread across the year. But there are claims the hotel will alienate the average family. Well, I think uh, developments uh, such as this uh, clearly are turning Rottnest Island into a rich man's playground. The WA Tourism Commission says the hotel will attract national and international visitors and fills a gap in accommodation needs. On the streets today, similar support. It would be worth it because Rottnest is so nice. Yeah, people would like it, I reckon. It looks like it ties in pretty well with like, the environment there, which is probably the, the main thing about Rottnest. The public now has 21 days to submit their feedback on this design and the developers hope to sign off on the final plan by next June. Louise Momba, Nine News.